This video is sponsored by BuyCheapMuttCoins.com. Make sure you guys head on over there for all your coin purchases, anything revolving mutt. Make sure at checkout you use code GS5. Helps you out. You get a nice little discount. Helps me out. It's a win-win situation, baby. Go on ahead, BuyCheapMuttCoins.com and use code GS5. What is going on, guys? Your boy GS. Today we have an online gameplay. We are going up against a subscriber. We're going up against Jimmy McQuid, my Irish brethren. Uh, hopefully you guys are, uh, you know, enjoying your beautiful, beautiful Sunday afternoon. By the time you guys hear this, it should be afternoon. We're going with the Steelers, and uh, my opponent is going with the Ravens. So like I said, man, hopefully you guys are enjoying your weekend, having a beautiful day. And uh, we're going to try to, uh, you know, take your mind off of the world with these videos, baby. Just relax. Um... Um... Just relax, baby. Calm, calm down, baby. Calm down. So... Um, we got the Steelers, as I've mentioned, man, and, uh, one thing really quickly is I did the, uh, gauntlet video yesterday. I love doing the gauntlet videos, even though I made it to that stupid thing where there's 97,000 cameramen on the field. That confused the hell out, confused the hell out of me. But somebody suggested that, uh, we could probably do that every Friday, going alphabetical order. I think we're, that's what we're going to do. We're going to do that every Friday. Now, um, I'm going to play the franchise game today, and, um, it should go up tomorrow. And then I'm going to do, um, let me know uh, if you guys would prefer a 2K video, an NHL video, or a FIFA video. So let me know which one you guys would prefer. Uh, tomorrow we're probably going to try to do four videos for the first time. See how it goes, you know, a couple, um, couple online gameplays mixed in with either a 2K, NHL, FIFA, whatever you guys like. And then maybe a G-Strokes of uh, the uh, Madden franchise or... Or maybe NHL and NBA. I'm not sure. But, you know, again, leave in the comment section what you guys would uh, prefer. So, uh, right here, first drive, man. Just try to make it do what it do, baby. We're trying to hit him with that blunt. Trying to hit him with big old... Excuse me. Had a mini hiccup right there. Big old stink blunt right here, first down. Quick little... Is that an out route? Is that me using... I've never used out routes this year because they don't... They're not as effective as they were before. But look at that juke, though. Juking is where it's at. Juking this year... It, it's it's where it's at, man. I'm telling you, man. You get yourself you get yourself some nice jukey moves, man. You you will find yourself destroying defenders, oftenly, oftenly. I oftenly go. Is that a word? Often. I don't. If it's not a word, you guys know I'm not smart. We all know I'm not smart. Okay. Well, if you ever feeling down, just click on a random video, and I'm gonna say something like, "Wait a minute, this dude's an idiot," and then you realize <laughs> I'm smarter than that guy. <laughs> Always, always, whenever you're feeling down, maybe somebody calls you, like, you, even that kid, you know, 9 plus 1, no, I'm not, 21, even that kid will look at me like, yo, you're stupid, and I'll be like, you know what, you're right, <laughs> so, uh, if it is a word, then great, disregard what I said, look at me with this funky camera angle, man, I got, uh, they did that on purpose, man, it's rigged, that camera view is rigged, hit me with the bird's eye view, like, what, I don't want to see 97 feet above me, I don't want the aerial sky blimp, or blimp, you know what I mean, I don't want that view, uh, right there, nice pass over the middle, thought that might have at least gotten, you know, batted down or something, then he actually goes into the end zone, and uh, he ends up scoring, so he has himself a lead, so right now it's, uh, it's 10 to 7, and, uh, actually, uh, this is, you're gonna see me, um, pretty much using the same plays on both sides of the ball, so it's kind of like, uh, me trying stuff out, Labbing stuff. Uh, T Raw uh, found uh, a new blitz, which is definitely a good blitz, man. It's out of uh, 4 6, which is in his ebook. And uh, for the this is the first time I'm ever trying it. And I literally did it the entire game. I didn't change it. I knew he was killing me underneath drags. I was just like, I wanted to work it out to see if I could get the adjustments down to see how I could work with it. And offensively, you see me doing a lot of pistol, a lot of uh, full house, and a lot of things like that. Because again, that's stuff I want to work on as well. So right here, you see me sticking in. You know, the same play, and I I didn't get it, uh, rarely did I get the setups right. <laughs> you know, rarely did I, uh, was I able to do it and got the setups right. I was failing every single time, and he was destroying me. And, um, but this is how you learn. You know, this is how, uh, you lab. You know, this is what it is you want to do to perfect whatever it is you're trying to do. You know, I'm running the exact same def defensive play literally every play, and he's destroying me. But it's like, um, I got to figure out. How to stop what he's doing on top of trying to get the setups right and get the blitz right. You know, when the blitz is like now, I know how to set it up now. I was doing it completely wrong this game. But um, let's say if you want to work on, um, like this is the first Madden, honest, on my son's life. This is the first Madden I've ever 
went to a practice mode and legit tried working on stuff. Because usually I work stuff in-game. But zones played so good. And during the beginning of the year, everybody was doing cover threes, cover threes, cover threes, cover threes. And I had trouble, as you guys know, I still do kind of um, getting deep passes. If it's like third and 10, third and 11, I'm in trouble. I don't know any deep routes that work uh, very good against zones because they work so well. And... Um, so I went there and I just stood in cover three and I tried every play and I just wanted to work to see what was going to work against this damn cover three that was killing me. And I kind of figured some stuff out. So now I kind of have a little bit more of an arsenal when it comes to moving the ball, you know, semi deep, you know. And um, so that's what you want to do, man. You want to get in the game. You want to continuously keep doing it over and over and over, even though I'm getting my teeth stomped in. <laughs> I figured out what it was I was doing wrong towards the end. Now, as far as running pistols, you see me doing an offense. I, I think that's something I got to implement more. I don't really work with triple options, read options. I don't really do that uh, a lot, but I, I think it can be effective if you if uh, you sprinkle it in uh, here and there. You know, you work on it a little bit, you get your timing right, and it should be, uh, you know, pretty good. And like I said, I'm working on that offense and uh, didn't do too good this game. But like I said, it's just trial and error, you know, um, just trying to learn what it is that we can do to make it better. And, um, so yeah, so defensively, uh, we got it going together a little better. Next game, you're going to see me do it a lot better. Like I said, this game, we definitely just did not do it right at all. So, um, not only did we not do it right, we were trying to send pressure and we sent none. We got our teeth stunt. He beat the living hell out of us. He, he didn't care that we were trying new stuff. He, he came out guns blazing and beat the hell out of me. So good game, Jimmy. Um, let's so we were trying stuff on defense and it just didn't work out at all. <laughs> and he beat the hell out of me. But next video, you guys see, we got it going a, a little better. I finally got the setups right. So that's the end of the game, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. It's your boy GS and we are out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.